Man, I really cannot wait till I can do videos in civilian clothes again. But anyways, the Microsoft Surface Book. It's been out for about nine months now. And is it finally worth buying? Let's talk about it. All right, so like I said, the Microsoft Surface Book is Microsoft's first attempt at making a laptop. I've already done a few videos on this. I've done some reviews on it, and this thing has been out for about nine or ten months now. So it's coming up on its year anniversary, and uh, it is a great laptop. I really like it. I mean, my reviews have always been favorable for it, but I can honestly say that uh, probably the first six months of this thing's existence, it was really plagued with bugs. I mean, had I not been in Afghanistan, I would have returned this within two weeks because for the longest time, I had to do a restart almost every day. I had the sleep issues where when I woke it up, it would essentially freeze up, lock up, and I had to do a hard restart every time to get it to go. But thankfully and luckily, Microsoft has released some software updates, some major firmware updates in the last six months. And I would say it's been probably three months ago. There was a big update, probably March, April timeframe, uh, that actually finally fixed all my issues. So for me, the Microsoft Surface Book is finally bug free, which is a good thing. Um, but I can initially tell you that um, prior to that, so probably for the first six or seven months of this thing's life, it was not worth buying because of all the issues. Like I said, the hardware is awesome. It's always been awesome, but the software, I don't know, it was Windows 10 or just the, um, the drivers for this thing were just terrible. I mean, but now I can honestly say uh, it is a good time to buy this. Obviously, the, all the rumors are about about the Surface Book 2, but I can tell you that this thing has been going on sale. Microsoft's been throwing a lot of deals, so if you go to the Microsoft Store or their website, you can usually get this for a couple hundred dollars off, not to mention a lot of cases they've been actually throwing in the docking station for free, which I have and I highly recommend. Uh, maybe I'll do a review on that. But uh, I definitely got to say, to kind of complete my thought here, that this is worth buying now. But I, I will tell you, like I said, when this first came out, not so much. So like most first generation products, they're always gonna have bugs and it's always better to wait. But um, I was getting ready to go to Afghanistan. So I literally bought this a week before I went to Afghanistan and um, I wanted it, I wanted to try it. And I could say that it was definitely frustrating there for about six months. Um, like I said, it was still good. Once it was up and running, it was powered on, it was fine, but it's just, Having to restart it almost every time I took it from hibernation or sleep was just a pain in the butt. Uh, maybe you want to throw it across the room a few times. But I can honestly say now that uh, it's very rare that I have to do a restart on this thing. I mean, the latest updates have fixed all my issues with the sleeping, um, the camera, the Windows Hello has all been working flawlessly. So I can definitely, without a doubt, recommend this now. So. I'm curious if there are any Surface Book owners out there or if those of you who actually bought this and returned it, um, what your guys' thoughts are on this. Like I said, I think now it is a phenomenal laptop. It is definitely worth buying. Like I said, you can get this probably $150 to $200 off of what it came, what it cost you on the release date. Not to mention, you could probably get a docking station thrown in by Microsoft to sweeten the deal. So with that, like I said, I'm very happy with it. As you can see, I'm rocking the UAG case. Um, which I did a review on that as well. But um, I love my Surface Book now, but I honestly hated it for about the first six months. But um, in summary, I would definitely say this is worth buying. If you're on the fence about this, or you're due to upgrade your laptop and wanted a Windows laptop, um, I do highly recommend it. I think it's a great piece of hardware. I still love the design, especially the hinge. Like I said, it's covered with a case right now, but. The hinge design is probably one of my favorite features of this and just the ability to detach it and use it as a clipboard. So hopefully that guys helped you out if you were in the market for one of these. And uh, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And if you've not subscribed, uh, feel free to do so. Thanks.